Astronomers believe they have found an exoplanet circling a faraway star that might be a super-Earth with an ocean covering the whole surface. And they want to use NASA's James Webb Space Telescope to discover more about the planet's composition. Named TOI 1452b, the planet is 70% bigger than the Earth and is located 100 light-years distant from the Earth in the constellation Draco, around a red dwarf star. Initial observations and estimates suggest that the planet is five times denser than Earth, which might be compatible with a surface covered in a very deep ocean, while almost being twice as large. Astronomers have speculated that the planet may either be a large rock with very little or no atmosphere, or a rocky planet with an atmosphere composed mostly of hydrogen and helium. Scientists estimate that the water makes up around 30% of the mass of the planet if it's a real water world. That would be on par with the watery moons of our solar system, such as Jupiter's Ganymede and Callisto, or Saturn's Titan and Enceladus, which are thought to conceal vast seas under their icy surfaces. Researchers have found exoplanets before they suspected could be water worlds, but Charles Cadieux, PhD, who led the discovery team at the University of Montreal, said, This new planet is one of the best candidates for an ocean planet that we've found to date. Its radius and mass suggest a much lower density than one would expect for a planet that is basically made up of metal and rock, like Earth. Whether or not it's covered in water, the planet's 11-day orbit around its star means that life on this world would move at a breakneck speed. According to NASA, the planet gets approximately the same amount of sunlight that Venus does in our solar system, since the star it circles is smaller and colder. The exoplanet was identified by a group from the University of Montreal, and it is well situated to be studied by the upcoming James Webb Space Telescope. The distance of 100 light years makes the planet accessible year-round for Webb Space Telescope. The team that made the discovery has announced they would use Webb to record sunlight passing through the planet's atmosphere in order to learn more about the planet's makeup. Our observations with the Webb Telescope will be essential to better understanding TOI 1452b, said University of Montreal professor René Doyon, who is also the principal investigator of NIRIS, one of the four science instruments of the James Webb Space Telescope. As soon as we can, we will book time on the Webb to observe this strange and wonderful world. What do you think? Could this planet host life? Let us know in the comments section. And as always, if you want to learn more about space and stay up to date, like, subscribe, check out our previous videos, and visit our website if you love reading at www.nasaspacenews.com. Thanks for watching.